friends, I'm here to share with you guys my Bath and Body Works candle, White Barn um, haul. When I had gone over there last week, I shared that on my Instagram and on my Facebook page. And I wanted to show you guys really quick. So they gave me a nice um, coupon for next time and then how to use their candle. But I got a crate. <laughs> so there's another two, but it's nice because they give me this nice crate which I really love because this is where I store my candles into um, my cabinet here into the studio. I have a bar here in um, one of the cabinets. It's just specifically for um, for my candles. And um, before anything else, <clears throat> I wanted to share with you guys. I tried to make this video yesterday, but it was so dark because we had a thunderstorm that the lighting was really, really horrible. But um, let me change my lighting a little bit. I went ahead and um, change change my lighting but um okay let me share with you guys uh, first about how why I love white barn for my candles I used to be also into the um, the Yankee candle but I really felt that going into Bath and Body Works and getting my candles there was more of a customer friendly experience each time I go to Bath and Body Works you know someone always greets you offers you a bag offers you um, help of what scents and and whoever you stop they're always just very helpful with Yankee Candle I don't know if it's because the store is always smaller compared to Bath and Body Works but there's not um, there's an associate behind the register maybe um, there's one walking around but even if you're just the one or two or three in there they're not as friendly they're not as um, easy going that's how my own experience so then I switched over to um, just the white barn and I, I love it and now they are redecorating their whole bath and body works um, stores mine just got finished about three weeks ago when I went in there last week the gal was saying that they've only had it open the way um, it's newly decorated for about two weeks so I don't know maybe if you haven't been to your Bath and Body Works in a while um, maybe they have redecorated as well so check them out it's beautiful they have new lines it's just like a one shop um, everything they even have like the melts like the Scentsy uh, wax melt and the um, the warmers. I did not see a diffuser though, so maybe they do have it. I just didn't see it. So it's worth giving it a try and see if it you know it works out for you. I only saw I only saw I think maybe five different scents, but I will check them out and see um, what I think about them. I think they were like three three for fifteen dollars, but they were like small. So uh, I kind of just wanted to use my coupon for the candles. Okay. But if you ask them, they will give you a box. And the nice thing is that um, they re also revamp their, their box. Um, it comes in like this, nice blue color, dark brown, and then it even says white barn. They give you a nice blue ribbon to match the box. White barn lettering um, in brown to, ma to match the outside of the box. And then they give you free... Um, matches so that's really nice if you want to give it as a as a gift to somebody and that's why I always um, stock up on candles whenever they have their big sale so last week um, they had the buy two at regular price which was the the prices varied from $22.50 or $24.50 but you buy two you get two free and then they also had a coupon for $10 off a $30 purchase so my candles because again, um, some are 22 and some are 24. The lowest candles I had was like 9.95, and then the others were like 10.19. So that's that's a really good price for me to stock up because I do use it as gifts, especially the holidays are coming up. Maybe for Kumu or for the assistant or for a friend. It's it's beautiful gift, beautiful packaging, perfect for a gift um, to give out. Okay. So let me show you guys my um, my favorite things at the Bath and Body Works of the White Barn Candles is their new collection of, I don't know what you call this. I think it's Camp, is it Camp Winter or just Camp? I think it's called Camp Winter. Look at this. So this is the hot cocoa and cream. And then I have my cheat sheet, so I have my computer. You know what? 
all this time I was making the sensi video since I started showing my face, I'm like reaching out, right? <laughs> this is my keyboard. I could have just had it right here in front of me instead of just reaching out. Okay, just figured that out today. <laughs> all right, so let me let me figure it out. What um this is the hot cocoa. I'm like a hot mess every time. I make a video with you guys. It's like, I just, I, do, I wing it. Her hubby's like, you gotta do a script. And I'm like, I ain't got no time for that. I barely have time it is just to be doing a video. Okay, hot cocoa and cream. And how cute is that? It comes with this nice, um, like a dark copper lid. And also just to let you guys know, because some of these lids have this one, I do switch them out. And I did ask um, a gal like years ago, I was like, is it okay if I switch out the lid? They're like, yeah, it's fine. Just go pick out a lid that you want. So they have these um, shiny copper and then they have more like a bronze copper. And then they had like, you know, just, a, um, just their plain um, metallic ones. But I do like this one. All right, so Bath & Body Works says that their hot cocoa and cream, which is part of their camp winter collection, is um, made with notes of milk chocolate, steamed milk, and nutmeg essential oils. So as I'm reading this, it says made with essential oils. And that's what it says with all their, their camp winter um, candle brand. Oh my gosh. You can really... Oh, it smells really good. Jonathan would love this. He's really into like the hot chocolate smell. He would love, he's gonna ask to put this into his room, but I don't like to have the kids have candles into his room, into their room, because just in case, um, uh, safety hazard wise. But what I have been telling Jonathan, because he is a lot older, is like, okay, if you cook, if you put a candle on, use a timer, always, always use a timer. Time it for like, a, you know, just like 30 minutes. When the timer goes off, go ahead and, um, and turn it off. But also just use a candle when you're physically in the room. When you leave the room, all I have them do instead of blowing it out is just I put the lid over. They say not to do that, but honestly, I don't. And it's worked many years. All I do is just, you know, just put it like this for a little bit until the flame subsides. And then when it does, I close it and then I open it up and then just close it just to have that air pop out. But I like to burn candles because, um, especially for those quick, quick smell, quick, strong smell, um, when a friend or someone's coming over and they give you that 15 minute warning or five minute warning, like, hey, I'm almost at your house. And you're like, oh yeah, sure, come over, I'm, I'm home. And then you just rush and you, <laughs> you light up a candle. I don't know if everybody does that, but I do that. So this one really smells good, really smell the, the hot chocolate, the, the cocoa smell. I don't smell too much of the nutmeg. It's more of like the steamed milk and the, and the chocolate. It smells really, really good. It's perfect um, for the winter holidays. Got that. Um, I got two, four, six. I think I picked out every single one of their camp winter collection only because I love the vintage look to it um, so much. And what I do with my um, empty candles is that, especially this one, look how pretty that is. So once that goes out, I'm not gonna throw it. I clean out the inside. I just soak it with hot water. Once it's really down to the bottom, soak it with hot water and the whole thing just pops out. And then I just I just clean it out with um, hot soap and hot water and it, it really turns out really good. Cleaned out and then I use like cotton balls and this is perfect for the kid's room, Jonathan, Jonathan's room. He can put um, his coins in here. He has a lot of loose change around his desk. So then that's perfect for that. Okay, so this one is the Campfire Donut. <clears throat> and let's see what um, Bath & Body Works. Also, um, if you guys go into their website, because I'm currently into their website, it says 25% off your entire order and then it gives you a code um, to use. This one, this one's really good too. Um, I don't know if I smell like a donut, what does it say? Made with notes of powdered sugar, glazed donut, and cedar wood essential oil. Again, I like the fact that they use essential oil. Cedar wood, it's not strong at all. It's very soft and 
subtle but still have that nice uh, that nice like sweetness to it very it's subtle but definitely it's, it's a good scent it's not overpowering at all so that's uh, perfect okay you know what I got look at this cute one. Oh my gosh look at this oh the thing with all of these is that they have this frosted glass um, look so there's the lid I like that but all around like this is like a Christmas red and if you guys can see it's frosted this one the hot cocoa is a frosted brown again just the container itself you can reuse it hit that okay this one is also available in like their wall fragrance and currently their wall fragrance I think it um, ends today but it's like three dollars and fifty cents so those ends today um, as far as that scent that's the only one I, um, I see wallflower and this one for the spice apple it says spice apple today or nope spice apple toddy with the reindeer and the red hat cute okay so Bath and Body Works says and this is a brand new scent so it has a new um, sign to it it says made with cinnamon really yeah you can smell the cinnamon and clove you can smell the clove made with cinnamon and clove essential oils and notes of apple brandy I like this one for the fall it's a bit stronger than the others because of that cinnamon and clove and it's perfect for the fall all along the winter too I, it's, it's perfect for the holidays I love this scent very nice so far this is my top one although the hot cocoa is just going up there because that's just a sweet cocoa smell it's just like you close your eyes and you want to you want to drink it okay another camp winter oh no I might have to pick up another one look at my sticker oh my goodness this is why I bought it was because of the uh oh okay but anyways I can't return because I already I already um burned this so I burned this in my bedroom when I first um the first day I had it because I just had to try it out I like how it has the the Jeep it says frosted ginger and because I like I like um, cranberry I like cranberry scents I just think cranberry scents is perfect for the holiday and and then it's it's strong but yet not overpowering with um, with spices added to it very nice okay okay so frosted cranberry is made made with notes of ice cranberries and orange essential oils this was very nice to to burn um, it gave that it, it just gave that clean scent but yet not springy not springy flowery clean um, clean but yet you can feel the holiday warming up into your into your room as it's burning and it's it was really nice it's um, it's a nice overall smell. I, I like it. Like I said, it's cranberry is just one of my favorites. I just really like that one. Okay, I think this is the last one of my um, camp winter. So I got two, four, five. I thought I got six camp winter ones. How cute is that? So this is just the winter. Nice, um, nice lid. And it has a nice bear to it white frosted glass all around and then this one this one is very um more into more into the december more into the the the, the feeling of like the snow falling so this is available um for the wallflowers wallflowers as well and they just have so much brand so much good brands of um like for the holiday collection they um the way they're redoing their store it's just it's beautiful it's gorgeous you know I just you guys just you, you guys need to check it out it's really gorgeous this one winter I'm looking outside because we're, we, ha we still have our winter storm coming in today this one says um, made with orange and fur needle essential oils and notes of clove yes 
this is why I said that this is um, good when when you want the feel of like the snow and the winter and Christmas this is perfect to burn um, Christmas morning it's just you can really smell the, the the fur needles of a Christmas tree so I would definitely burn this while kids are opening their presents um, and really feel that Christmas feel especially if you live in a place that that you don't get the snow you don't get the very cold cold air cold winter air then burn this so then your house smells like very Christmassy oh okay I'm, I'm so happy with everything that I bought with the um, the camp winter collection so I have three more and then before I go into like the other one this is still part of the holiday and I had which one is it I had burnt one yesterday so for this one I have these two and this one says eat dessert first and I don't know what um, collection this is but it's it's pretty so it's more into their like fall, um, fall scents. I think this is more like, I don't know, they're fall and winter, but this one was definitely uh, fall because it was just like pumpkins everywhere. This one is called the best fall treat, um, caramel pumpkin swirl. When I smell it, it's sweet, it's nice, and that's the reason that I picked this up and I wanted to share this with you guys. If you guys really like that subtle, um, that subtle scent of a, uh, of of caramel and pumpkin yes definitely pick this up but to tell you the truth when I burnt it for about 30 to 40 minutes I don't know if because I have the other scents maybe that that could be the reason why is because I had my scentsy wax scents being melted but this one was in my kitchen counter and I was around the kitchen counter I barely smelled it and I can smell it through the um, through the jar, and it smells like you know, still soft and subtle, but burning it very subtle to the point that I couldn't smell it. So I wasn't um, too happy with the performance of this one. Um, Bath and Body Works says this one is um, fresh pumpkin, warm caramel, grated cinnamon, and vanilla bean. Definitely, you can smell the vanilla bean very 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 mild of the cinnamon um, cinnamon scent but yes the caramel is there and mild again on the pumpkin so performance wise I think it, it was too subtle but if you want that that subtleness into your home then yes pick this up okay the last fall um, scent I have or holiday scent I have is the um, this one look at that Look at their branding, it's just so cute. And this one is not paper like the other one, it's more like plastic sticker. So I like that one, so this one is going to be much easier to wash uh, and get wet compared to the other one because this one is more of a paper when I clean it out. Okay, so this one, Life is Sweet. So, mm, I can still smell it. Okay, so this one has the bright copper lid. This one's a bit more stronger than, than this one. I'm just afraid though, because they're in the same line, that when I burn it, it's going um, to be subtle as well. But Bath & Body Works says this is a creamy vanilla. Yeah, I can, I can really smell the creamy vanilla in here pumpkin spice, homemade marshmallow, and drizzled caramel. I can smell the little, the spice in there, just a little, very subtle. Like again, um, I said, it's just, if you like the subtle scents, then these two are, are perfect. Because like for this one, the spiced apple really gives you that strong um, fall scent. So I think I'm just gonna, Mm, I don't know. I think I'm gonna gift this one. So this is a perfect gift to someone because I never know if they want something too strong or not. So I think that would be a overall nice gift to um, to give someone for like Thanksgiving, especially when we get invited to um, a friend's house for a Thanksgiving. It's nice to give them a little hostess gift. So I usually give like a wine to share um, for dinner, but then a nice um, candle like this would be perfect um, gift as well. Okay, last one. So the last candle, nice copper, and um, <clears throat> this one is just, 
this one is new and this one I picked up because I didn't want to overdo it with the fall and the winter scent. So I wanted to have um, a candle that's going to go towards more like the winter, um, late winter, January, February into the into Valentine's Day and stuff like that. So I picked this up. This is called the Grapefruit Gin Fizz. Look at that pretty pink color. Look at that. This one I really like. Uh, you can still smell the winter scent in there. If you close your eyes, you can still feel like it. Okay, it's 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 perfect for the winter. It is for the winter, not the fall though. I don't think it's for the fall, but still, I burn candles year round of different scents. But it has that because of it being grapefruit. It has that clean, refreshing. But then they put some sort of a spice in here to make it like feel like still the holidays. Ruby red grapefruit. Sparkling water. How can you have a sparkling water scent? I don't know. It's like sparkling water. Like what? What scent would that be? Okay, but ruby red grapefruit sparkling water juniper juniper gin So they have that juniper in there to make it feel like um, it's still part of the the holiday, which is really nice Really nice. I really love this one out of all of them. I think this is like really my favorite favorite Per se, just because it's just, you know, I'm, I'm that clean, refreshing scent kind of girl. Um, okay, well, that's that's all I have for my candle haul. Shared with you guys all the scent. Overall, I'm really happy with all of them. Um, maybe this one, because it is a light scent. Maybe I can just try it into the bathroom or my bedroom to where it's like a smaller room and not have my other wax, um, scentsy wax uh, melting. And then I can just concentrate on, on this smell. So I definitely, I, I wasn't dissatisfied with it. It just felt like it wasn't a very strong performance, but maybe that's what happened um, to me. Okay. Let me show you guys my little brochure so I can show you and share with you. So it's nice that they give you guys the, the little brochures of what's coming. So this one is the um, Christmas gift shop. And see how pretty. Like I said, they're redoing their brand. Very nice. And then here's um, candles in the back. That's more for the... Um, the shines, the metallic vanilla spice pear frosted cranberry, which is this one. Oh, so they have their frosted cranberry, which is the middle, which is this scent, but just different packaging. Perfect for, perfect, just to give out. Okay, and then they have the evergreen, and then here's some new candles. And then they give you um, coupons, free item of your choice. So that's really nice. They give you coupons. So I have two of that. And then they give you a coupon code at the back, I think. Yeah, free item. Okay, yeah. So hopefully you guys can get some coupon when you when you um, stop by the, the store and pick up some new scents. But again, like I said, just check it out. Go to your mall. We haven't been to our mall in like eight months, so I was really surprised um, to see it. It was really nicely decorated, but check them out. I love Bath & Body Works. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you guys for visiting A Simply Simple Life. Mahalo!